The vest pack. The vest pack. Okay. I like it. Designed for hydration in the back. They all come, well, I take it back. You can either wear the hydration, like this pack. This pack is set up with hydration in the back. Your flowers and everything in the front. You can also wear it just, just as a front by what we call a mono strap. In other words, no hydration. You're going out for a couple hours, eh, don't want to take the hydration, you want to be as light as possible. Everything is waterproof, including all of the uh, electronic bags, like this one for your iPod, waterproof earbuds, and then you, we also have them for the phone, like on this one. All of our bags are electrostatic, which means everything on the phone itself works while it's in the bag, and you can also use it to talk while it's in the bag. Once you put it, there's a reason you put it in the bag. If you're in the water, you don't take it out. So the touch, it does, no touch screen, all that stuff works. All the touch screen works on all of our, these are demos, they're uh, actually dead ones we get from our Radio Shack guy when they die so we can show them off, but yeah, touch screen works. Then, of course, here's the easiest one. Everything is Velcro based, so you can take them in, put them out. If you look at the, my flies down here on the floor, that is a tackle bag. It contains all the flies that I normally use when I'm fishing, of course, for trout, but it can be also for salt water. The nice thing with the tackle bag is it can be attached to the pack on the straps, or it can be attached to the boat via the Velcro with our bo boat patch. Then, if you want to change flies, walk out of the boat with a different fly or a different tackle, you can take this, you can open a, one of these, simple as that. Now you've got whatever new flies you've, you've put in your vest. It comes with the zingers so for your tools, so your nippers or whatever tools you normally use. For me it's nippers, dry fly floating. What makes the uh, pack so nice is, I don't know if you can see it, but it's 10 millimeters of air around your body, both front and back and it will take any kind of a load. You could stand on this and not crush it. You can't crush it. You can pinch it, but when you put a load spread out across it, you cannot crush it. And what's nice about this material is it's water resistant. Same with the neoprene that we're using in the pack. So it's lightweight and totally breathable around the body. If you notice, I have it both in the front of my pack and especially in the back.